one. Hi, NJ Coffee Junkie here, coming to you from the great state of New Jersey and the Shamblecraft server. I'm here in my basement, hanging out, chilling with my friends back here as I get together some supplies. I sorted over 20 shulker boxes down here that I had just randomly gathered full of materials. And then checking out the zombie XP farm, I had another 15, 15 that I had to go through. So right here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all of um, all these books and all these bookshelves and everything else. And I'm going to grab some leather because we really need it. And I'm going to even going to go ahead and grab a lot of paper here. And I probably should also, since I do have an extra empty shulker here, I should probably go ahead and get a hold of uh, some wood so that uh, I can go ahead and, not the crimson, we need the crimson for the base, but go ahead and, ooh, a full shulker of spruce. Yes, that's what we want. We want a full shulker of spruce. Now, my book bag is empty, so I'm going to go ahead and throw all of this wonderful stuff in here. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. Let's let's throw that apple in there, too. I don't know why, well, uh, we don't know why that's there, but it's there. And let's take a field trip over to my leather shop, my refurbished shop, my consignment shop, which we haven't been to in quite a while. And head on over there and let's go ahead and restock ourselves because word is there are some sales so I'm going to go make my way over there and I'll catch you in a moment Whee! all right we made it up to the nether roof and we are making our way quickly over to the cow assignment shop we have Mutha and Sheepy here keeping an eye on everything and let's see what kind of sales we have ooh we are running out of chainmail i'm going to have to go grab my chainmail box and get over there and get some sales in uh looks like leather gear is not uh too popular ooh here we go we've got some diamonds for some leather awesome and i do have some leather in my book bag so we're going to grab my book bag and we're gonna go ahead and we are going to replace those two stacks of leather. I have, I think, one more stack of leather. Nope, that's the di those are the diamonds. Okay, so one more stack of leather. And grab my pickaxe and go. Okay, uh, did I grab that? Yes, I did, very good. Oh, there's another diamond. Okay, so leather, oh, another diamond. Like, oh, another diamond wonderful oh this is so good i love being able to provide things for my server mates here on shamblecraft now let's see stay safe zero days since last hoglin incident that carpet down here is really doing wonders it's doing the trick let's see okay so item frames are still okay uh we are out of books and we are running low on bookcases but never fear I have them all here. Let's grab our book bag. We have our golden stuff here. We have iron and stuff here. We have logs and bookshelves. So here we go. Let's go ahead and plunk that there. Let's grab these stacks of books. Now that I dropped off all of my leather, I have to go grab more leather. And we'll put that there like that. We'll do a, like a little flying V situation. Okay, so we've exhausted that. Uh, let's see. We And we have bookshelves coming out of our eyeballs. Perfect. Okay. So bookcases. Those are not bookcases, NJ. Wrong shulker. Okay. So while I go ahead and just restock everything here, I... Um, as I try to anyway. <laughs> I have been so hard at work getting all these bookcases done. 
and my server mates have been patiently waiting for me to restock my, my shelves here. And I'm so glad to provide uh, this library of resources to my server mates. It's just an absolute, it's an absolute delight to be able to do that. I, oh, I do have some leather. I should make more books because I need these barrels to be full. This I can take from here and then one from here so that uh, these shelves are more uh, uniform. I think that would be, I think that would be ideal if I remember how to do this properly. There we go, there we go, and there we go. A nice design, healthy design. We've got five diamonds in our pocket and we still have all these bookshelves to use and go for it. So let's see, let's fill this in. We'll fill that in and then do this and this and this. And then we will do this. And uh, I think we did it like this and this, and I think this and this. How did we do it on the other one? Oh, we just did it like that. Oh, we can do this instead. It's more, uh, I like that better. I like that better. So I think we're good here and we're pretty much good here. We're just gonna fill this top part in and boom. So all of our bookshelves, our bookcases are filled in and we do need more books. We do need more books. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna open the wrong shulker again and we're gonna open the other wrong shulker again because we can and we're gonna grab all this paper because we have to make books and we're gonna grab this shulker <laughs> we're gonna put that oh that shulker's empty <laughs> and jay what are you doing what am i doing i don't know um okay so let's grab this um we don't have a we don't have a crafting bench up here we're gonna have to race downstairs we always keep our crafting bench under here see there we go uh, boom, there we go. Done and done. Let's make as many books as we can. Okay, so we have uh, two stacks 21. That's not going to help us much. But at least we can get two more stacks of books for sale in here. Let's at least do that. So we'll do that and that. There's more leather. I have spruce logs, but I don't need them. I'm going to need this shulker. And then I'm going to have to clean up this mess that I made. I'm going to have to finish restocking and then we're going to go back to my base and we're going to see what we can do there. So let me do that and uh, I will see you at the base. And we're back at base. We have our unnamed professor joined by mittens this time. Peanut butter is over here somewhere. There's peanut butter. Peanut butter got loose and Mickness had to help me find poor peanut butter in the nether tunnel and had to uh, drag peanut butter back. Not necessarily, you know, like upset about it, but I mean, look at that face. That face wanted to explore, but right now it's only exploring the bed. <laughs> Go figure. Uh, right now I have a whole bunch of cake though, even though there's tons of cake around me because guess what? It's server mate Badger Spanner's birthday tomorrow. And a bunch of us are getting together and playing a birthday prank on her. Cause I mean, look at this, look what she did up here back in May. Look what she did. She left these llamas on my roof. Oh, or the ceiling rather. And they're gonna stay there. They're gonna stay there, but we have to return the favor in kind. So how are we going to do that? Well, first things first, I am going ahead with this purple shulker box that I have filled with various potions and a lot of cocoa beans because, quite frankly, she deserves it. Now, I need levels to name the shulker and the bottles of coffee, so I have to actually go ahead, run down to the zombie XP farm. First, I'm going to check, though, because... Uh, yesterday I was, yeah, it despawned. I was a, um, part of something on the server with a new shop. Whether or not it remains open is beside the point, but I was a target of, um, a hit, so to speak. And because, uh, the person who runs the shop said, uh, that they would open it. And I think it was for our player heads. And so they came after me, like they do. 
And I said, okay, well, if you're going to come at me, come at me. But I'm going to, you know, try to defend myself. And defend myself I did. Narrator. It did not go as well as she hoped. I got destroyed. They killed me not once, but twice. So that's a big old whoopsie on me. So I'm over here. And I realize that I should probably go over to the Ender Ender, or as um, I like to call it, the Ender Blender. Someone said Ender Blender to me, and it was just the best. The, it, it, the best name ever. So I'm actually racing now to our Ender Ender, because I need a lot of levels very quickly. And an Enderman farm is the best way to do it. Speaking of Enderman, though, I have to tell you that Fally, 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 oh goodness, he played a joke on me, sort of, where, and I posted this on Twitter a while back, but I had mentioned that I overcame one of my biggest Minecraft-oriented fears, which is Enderman. They terrified me. And after exploring in the end and everything else, I finally figured out how to get over that fear. And I said, oh, I'm not afraid of Enderman anymore. Yay, go me. And Joe of the Hills Variety said, I'm thinking of that, that, that Home Alone thing, that Home Alone scene. And Fally said, I'm already on it. And I went, oh no, here we go. And what we got was a 60 second masterpiece that has amassed over a thousand views, five or six from me because it's just so good, of my character here, of me, imposed on Kevin McAllister. <laughs> oh, somebody left this on. Okay, we, we're going to get levels now and I should probably turn down the Enderman sound because that is loud. We're going to do that. Hostile creatures off. Okay, there we go. There we go. We're back. <laughs> let's just let's just get our levels because the Endermen are so loud. <laughs> All right, we need I think about I think twenty levels. I think twenty or thirty levels will do. So let's get up there. We're gonna hear some ding ding dings. We're just gonna keep slashing, 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 going after those Enderman knees like we do like we do. Um, yeah, I think 30 levels will be good. I think 30 levels will be fine because I want to name the box and everything in it. So let's keep going here. And now as a good server mate, when you're building an Enderman farm, you want to have a way to shut it off. So we have the spawning button off because we don't want to keep it spawning. So right now what I'm doing is I am, I am clearing the farm out so that there aren't so many entities here. Come on. Don't be shy. Come on out. There we go. Get in. Come on. You're, you're, you too. That's right. You too. Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay. And so then what we do is you put on the filter and that makes all of, oh, there's Enderman heads in there. Did I get an Enderman head? Oh, I want an Enderman head so badly. I don't, come on, give me the Enderman head. Look at that. I want the Enderman head so bad. Come on. <laughs> Maybe if I keep dumping Enderman pearls, I'll keep getting, I'll get the head. Maybe. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Ah, come on before it disappears. I want one. Oh my gosh. Look at all these pearls. Well, they're still going. And I have to, um, okay. So that got swept up. But as long as I attempt to throw these pearls, they're probably getting stuck here. So. Oh, wait, I think it's, I think if you do Q, oh, they're just going to end up there. Why won't they, why won't they go further than that? That makes no sense. Huh. All right. Well. Yeah, there's some sort of, there's something here. There's something here that's blocking it, but I'm not sure what. 
I should be able to toss them in here without issue. But I'm going to have to figure that out another time because I have my levels. But I don't know... I don't know where the thing is. Now, am I going to be able to get my head? I am. I'm going to take one of the heads. I just want one. So I'm going to take a thing of pearls and take one enderman head. And I'm actually going to put it on. Is it as scary as a silverfish? I don't know. Actually, silverfish is terrifying. But I think this I think this counts. <laughs> but I'll take those um oops. I'll take those ender pearls that I picked up and let's see. I think there's an open Nope! I didn't want to do that. Let me get those out of my off hand. Thank you. And let's get out of here. All right, so we are going to go ahead now, taking our time and not falling off the side like I did during a live stream not too long ago. Let's um, let's not do that. And we're going to make our way back. Now that we have these levels, we're going to head over to our anvils and then we're going to rename everything. So I will see you in just a teeny weeny bit. All right, so I am back here at my base in the basement. Look, I have a couple of anvils right here. I think what I'm gonna do is put away, where is the box known as Nightcrawler Orbs? There we go. So I have um, I have three shulkers full of, uh, full of ender pearls already, but I have this empty barrel. So let's take all the mm -hmm. ender pearls We'll get those put away because we need to finish what we're doing. We need to go visit Badger's place and we need to drop off the goodies that we uh, we have here. Uh, let's see. So we're going to need a sign. So let's go grab a sign because we have to put that there somewhere. And we're going to grab one sign because that's all we need. And let's go back over to the anvils. All right. So here we go. We're going to name the purple shulker first. We're going to say happy birthday badger love NJ. Excuse me. That's a J. Thank you very much. Boop. Oh, well, broke that. All right. So now what are we going to do? We are going to rename all these beans, and that's going to take eight levels. So we're going to say that these are coffee beans. Uh, coffee, uh, birthday coffee beans, or just, I think just coffee beans. I think just coffee beans. So we'll just say coffee beans, coffee beans. Okay, and we're just going to go ahead and redo this. Um, Badger knows that I love cocoa beans. I love to use them as coffee beans. That's my thing. And I want her, um, I want her to know that giving her something that is special to me um, shows how much I appreciate her as a friend. We've been friends now for a couple of years. We met through uh, the Joe Hills Discord. And we got to know each other on Shamblecraft, and she's just... Oh, I renamed it Cocoa Beans. That doesn't help any. Uh, whoops. Okay, let's see if I can do this and name everything properly. Imagine that. <laughs> okay, we're almost done here. Coffee Beans. Alright. And last but not least, I think we have one more after this. Coffee Beans. Okay, we have one more. Coffee beans. So, coffee beans. Okay, so I think that's all of them. Yes, okay. So we're going to put those back. And then we're going to take all these different potions, because I did grab 30 levels. So that should be enough to name everything here. So let's go. Let's grab all these different potions. Um... All right, first we're going to start with night vision, and this is the nocturnal blend. Nocturnal blend. 
So that's night vision. Potion of fire resistance. We're going to call this... Uh, the f uh, what should we call this? What should we call this? Let's see. Potion of fire resistance. We want to name this after coffee. So why don't we go ahead and call this... Uh, let's call this the... Let's call this a uh, latte blend. La uh, latte blend. No, actually, no. Milk would be a latte. Milk would be a latte. So perhaps maybe instead, we'll just we'll just call this uh, we'll call this the mild blend because you know fire resistance, spicy. So that's the mild blend. Luck is the. Uh, let's see. What is luck? Suerte. The suerte blend. Because luck is suerte, uh, suerte in Spanish. So that's suerte blend. Regeneration is uh, morning blend. Because regen wakes you up. You know, that's the sleepy... Oh, we're out of anvils. I have anvils upstairs. I have anvils upstairs. Let's take this. Come on. Come on. We're going to be quick. We're going to be quick. Can, can I take it? No. Okay, um, I will put those in there. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. We can do this, we can do this, we can do this. Quick like bunnies. Because we gotta get, we have to head over to her place before she wakes up. Okay, there's an anvil. Let's go, we're almost done, we're almost done. Okay, so we have the mild blend, the nocturnal blend, the suerte blend, the morning blend. We have invisibility, which is the secret blend. So we'll throw that in there for... Wait, is there more than one? There's regen, there's slow falling, there's healing, there's swiftness. Okay, no, there's not one. Secret blend. Slow falling is... Um, we're going to call this the decaf blend. <laughs> we'll call that the decaf blend. Water breathing. We're going to call this the... Um, we're going to call this water breathing. We're going to call this the... Aqua, aqua blend. Uh, hold on, no, 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 no. We'll call this. Um, we'll call this the light blend because it's water breathing and you can breathe underwater. I don't know. I'm making this up now as I go along. Potion of regen. I think there was another. Okay, so that's one regen. This is a different regen. Um, this is the speedy blend. Actually, no, speedy blend. We already have. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. This is this is regen. So the pick me up, pick me up blend. So that's that, and then we have speed, which is the extra caffeinated, e i extra caffeinated blend. Okay, there we go. We have them all. Good. Very good. Okay. So now let's take the purple shulker that we've named for Badger. And we're going to add everything in just kind of willy nilly. For now. For now. For now. And we'll just, we'll just put this over here. Put this over there. Put that there. Put that there. Put that there. Put that there. Boom. Done. And there, I'm going to put uh, two cakes on this side. Two cakes on that side. And there we go. So there. All right. So let's grab this. And we have one thing left to do, which is head over to Badger's. So I'm going to do that now. And after we get there, then we will uh, go ahead and set up her gift. Uh, I can't wait for you to see what Fally did. <laughs> Because <laughs> he, he showed us earlier, and you're going to see that in just a second. So sit tight. I'm going to make my way there. Okay, we finally made it to Badger's base. And yes, I'm still wearing the Enderman head. Hello! I have to say that... Badger is so good at building. Look at this building behind me. This is just next level. This is what I hope to be able to do someday. I've been trying to practice, but she's just so good. So good. And so here we go. This, this is what Fally did for Badger for her birthday. 
It's just too perfect. I love it so very much. I love it so very much. And he left this for her and I think it's I think it's sublime. But I'm going to head back up to her house because I think I want to leave her gift over here because that's Fally's gift and I don't want to take away from that. I don't want to take away from that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it right at her doorstep. I'm going to leave it right at her doorstep. And then I'm going to put this cake here. And I'm going to... Can I... I can open it. Good. Okay. So I'm going to put a sign on it like that that says happiest of... Hold on. I got to fix that. That doesn't look right. Happiest of birthdays badger. And then a little heart on the bottom. Done. Okay. So now you're probably wondering what's left, NJ. Well, this book. See, th oh, this is the mutton book. Okay. Well, you know what? We're going to take this, we're going to take this book and we're going to reuse it because I needed a book. And this was from a game that I didn't participate in. So sorry, Shep. But let's see. Badger. Uh, thank you. Actually, wait, no, that's cheesy. Happy birthday. Actually, no, I'm going to do one better. Someone once said, good friends are like strong cups of coffee. They open your eyes to the world. Thank you for being such a strong cup of coffee. <laughs> I know it's going to be cheesy. It's fine. Um, and, uh, by being... Uh, no. Thank you for being such a strong cup of coffee to me. Your friendship means more than words could properly articulate. I truly hope this year brings you so much joy and prosperity. Prosperity. I can spell, I swear. You deserve nothing less, my friend. Much love and hopefully we'll meet someday. NJ. I think that works. Someone once said, good friends are like strong cups of coffee. They open your eyes to the world. Thank you for being such a strong cup of coffee to me. <laughs> Your friendship means more than words could properly articulate. I truly hope this year brings you so much joy and prosperity. You deserve nothing less, my friend. Much love, and hopefully we'll meet someday. NJ. Happy birthday. There we go. So, we will... How are we going to do this? We can do this, then this, and then... Oh, I should have brought an item frame. That would have been perfect. So we'll do that and we'll do this and then we'll put this, we'll put that there. And well, actually, yeah, cause that's not going to work, but it's okay. It's okay. We'll make it work. You know what? Yeah. I'll just, I'll just keep these. That's fine. I'll just keep these coffee beans. That's right. Now it's symmetrical, it's symmetrical people. It's symmetrical. Yes. Symmetrical. All right. There we go. So I have left this, for, I have left this for her. I am so excited for it. I'm actually going to take a screenshot and then open it and take another screenshot so I can show my, my friends. And yeah, this is going to be, this is going to be pretty exciting. I cannot wait for her. I cannot wait for her to see it. Um, but with that, as I traverse this hallway and make my way through, I know that we didn't get to the base today. I know that we didn't really get 
too much stuff done, but I still think we did some stuff and we surprised our dear friend. So there are no complaints there. Uh, we'll just have to see where the next episode takes us. But with that, if you love this episode, if you like this episode, please feel free to hit like. And if you're not already subscribed to the channel, feel free to hit subscribe below. I really appreciate you and I hope that you all have a wonderful, wonderful day. Wear your masks, wash your hands, get vaccinated, and be excellent to yourselves and to each other. See you. Bye. I'm an Enderman. Ah. Rah.